Let's check the fridge. Yeah, we're definitely gonna make lunch then. Surprisingly, you have the ingredients to make pudding. Oh, pudding's easy. I, I can make pudding. Yeah, we got this. We're the main fucking character. You made the base with egg, milk, sugar, and other ingredients. How should you give it some scent? Scent? Wait, wait, how, what, what, how is this even a question? Why the fuck would we put cologne or vanilla ice cream in pudding? <laughs> delicious, delicious cologne. <laughs> you all seem really sad. I know it's tough. I still can't believe Mr. Moroka was taken from us. The faculty office is still in shock too. Yes, we're so sad. But we can't sob about it all day. Today we're gonna put the physical back in education. We're gonna play rugby. And don't even think about getting lazy because it's hot. It's hot. It's hot, but run. Keep running. Sweat. And then eat shaved ice. Because the shaved ice you eat after exercise is the best. Brain freeze. Oh yeah, <laughs> this guy's insane. You seem to be cool, Creamy. Answer me while running. What is the medical term for brain freeze? I don't know. What the fuck? I have to read all of them out loud, though. Let me let me try and read all of them. Intracranial hypothermitis, neurocapillary constriction, sphenopalatine ganglioneuralgia, trigeminal nocep. No susception. I I I will say if it's phenopalatine ganglion neuralgia, I'm going to eat my big toe. There's no there's no fucking way it's that. Neurocapillary has a potential for that, but trigeminal no susception also seems actually pretty stupid. I think it's one of the first two. Okay, let's break this down. I okay, I have a great way to exemplify this. My sweet grandma gave me homemade applesauce. And I made sure that this very kind gift from my sweet grandma of homemade applesauce is very cold. If I were to eat a copious amount of this applesauce very quickly, I might get a brain freeze. Very, like, like, very unlikely, but here we go. Nope. Hypothermitis feels like they just added a bunch of, they added itis to hypothermia. I feel like, mm, I feel like both of these just don't really, maybe I just don't know what a brain freeze really is then. Intercranial, yeah, no, no, I don't think it's the first one. I think it has to be the second one. I, it has to be two, but it just doesn't, it doesn't fit in my opinion. I swear to God, if it's three though. Okay, devil's advocate here. How about this? <laughs> if I guess something else and it's three, I'll eat my big toe. But if it is three and I guess it right, then I won't eat my big toe. Because sphenopalatine, I don't know ganglion neuralgia, whatever, but palate, like mouth, palatine of the mouth. Oh my God, I can't, it's, it's, Okay, okay, it's two or three. It has to be two or three. Hey, here's this. Eating a toe would be really cursed content to get clipped. So we're gonna we're gonna bet basically that there's no way the game would basically troll us with sphenopalatine ganglion neuralgia. And we're gonna go for two. Two. We're going two. I I hate myself that I'm I'm setting myself up here, but here we go. You gave the answer you thought was right. No! No! What the fuck? No! What? No! No! <laughs> Wrong! The correct answer is phenopalatine ganglion neuralgia. Okay, break down. Break this shit down for me. How is it that? How is it that? When you eat something cold like shaved ice, it constricts the flesh around the trigeminal nerve. Oh, so the trigeminal thing was actually de decently close. It's just 
cociception or whatever is not a word. As the nerve that tells your brain that your forehead hurts. And so you think your forehead hurts. All right, I can see you're all sweating hard. I am literally sweating right now. Yes, I am actually sweating right now. The more you sweat, the better the shaved ice will be when you're done. Your answer was incorrect. Classes have ended for today, and so has my career. You have no choice but to eat your toe. All right, all right, well. All right, yeah, here we go. Uh, God damn it. Uh, this is so cursed. This is so fucking cursed. <laughs> I'm not going to eat it. I'm just going to... Oh my god, this is... Oh fuck, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Doesn't count, it's not on camera. I'm not gonna show my fucking feet on camera. Are you guys insane? <laughs> uh. <laughs> I have, I have an, I am an athlete, y'all. I have, I have runner's foot. There's no way you guys want to see my feet. <sighs> All right. Well. Here, here is the fucking foot here. Here's the foot. Here's the foot. Ah! Ah! Um. <laughs> ah! 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 My lesson I've learned is now I'm going to uh, not bet on one in fours by saying I will eat my toe. <laughs> Central Shopping District. You came to Tatsumi Textiles. Senpai. Uh, gotta warn you, there's nothing fun in here. Aww. He's so insecure. Hey, Ma, I'm home. Uh, he's not here. She ain't here. What's she doing leaving the store open? Hanshan, there you are. Your mother's in the hospital. Wait, what? What the fuck? What? Why does this game have people just run in and say, your mother's dying? What the hospital? The hell? The hospital? And now the music changed. Fuck off, game. Let's hurry. Huh? Oh, y yeah. Uh, I need to go and see. I only heard from a customer, but she's at Inaba Municipal Hospital. Hurry, go! Yeah. Y yes, sir. Alright, let's run. Inaba Municipal Hospital. Nobody's here. Oh, Ma, you all right? You were taken to the hospital. Did someone do this to you? Goodness, but you look pale. Never mind me. What about you? Huh? You're okay? I wasn't taken to the hospital. I took someone. What the fuck, game? Why you gotta debate us like this? Huh? huh? The poor thing got hit by a bicycle right in front of our shop. He hit his head, so I had a doctor examine him. He said there's no damage, thank goodness. The one who hit him was a boy from your school. When he saw the poor child fall, he ran away. Why don't you find him and give him a little scolding? Oh, yeah. Mom, let's go. Mom's like, go kick that kid's ass, you know. Cut the crap. You've got no idea how I felt. Haha, <laughs> I'm fine. Your mother isn't kicking the bucket that easily. It's not like you get so worried over such a... It's not like you to get so worried over such a little thing. Hey, hey, don't gaslight him. Shut up, you old cow. You make me scared. I was all emotional. I was worried. Yeah. <sighs> Sorry. Sorry. Looks like it was no big deal. No, no. no I don't blame you. Hmm. Yeah. 
it's not just me, then I guess it's okay. Kanji still looks embarrassed. I thought I faced all of my bad parts back there. But not everything can change just like that, huh? Sorry for dragging you around. If I'd been by myself, I might have been even more scared. <laughs> Hope I can repay the favor. It seems you're able to support Kanji. You sense his trust in you. Hell yeah. All right. I'm going home. Aww. That boy. We were both going home. He didn't have to run away like that. Oh, you're cool, Barakun. You came to our store with Yuki-chan, right? You've been I've been hearing a lot about you from Kanji. Senpai this and Senpai that. He must really like you. I'm sorry to have made you both come all the way here. He hates hospitals, you see. Oh. Ah. His father, my husband, died here. Oh, Kanji happened to be somewhere else when he collapsed. So I think he was scared today. Ha, <laughs> but it's good to see you. He's always had trouble getting along with people. Didn't have any friends like you before. Hmm, because of his looks? No, he was so cute when he was young. When was it that he began to wear scary clothes like that? He would always rather play house instead of catch, or go to home ac instead of PE. So he never had any male friends, but the girls didn't accept him either. After a while, he started getting into fights every day and bleaching his hair. Oh, oh, sweet boy. I was worried about him, but lately he seems to be having fun. Please take care of him. Hmm. Nodders. Hmm. You feel you understand Kanji a bit more. You parted with Kanji's mother and went home. Oh. Central shopping district in front of Chinese diner Aya. You finished today's training and decided to stop by with Chie. Hmm. Steak bowl or a combo plate? The ultimate decision. Both! S stop it! Yeah, shut up, dumbass. Yeah, that's right. We all know it's time to cough up. What? This is it? Quit bullshitting us. That that voice. It can't be. Let's go, Kuobarakun. Let's stop some bullies. Yeah. Takashi? Hey, someone's here. Whatever, let's take their money while we're at it. This bunk only had a thousand yen on him. All right, we are knights for justice. Ch Chie! Hey! What are you running for? Gonna hide behind a girl, huh? Do you know how hard this girl can kick? Fucking idiot. She'll punch you into space. Are you all right? Uh, I'm fine. You've always been good at stuff like this. They took all my money. You're gonna get them for me, right? Well, it does tick me off. Hey, cowards! Ganging up on one guy? You ought to be ashamed. T take care of them for me. Uh, uh, wait! Wow, that was fast. Sheesh. Oh, she's already in, like, fighting mode. Let's go. Come on, what's the matter? Let's throw down. Huh? What's with this bitch? Oh, did you just save this bitch to Chie? Oh, you, you're dead now. You're dead. You think you're all that? I ain't afraid to hit a girl. We'll kick your ass. The punks are aggravated by Chie's taunt. Things aren't looking good. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't like either of these choices. Why? Do, where is the fight with Chie option? In before the games, like, Chie's actually not that strong, and if she fought them, she would get hurt. Once again, dialogue options fail. Really, really, I know. Um, hold Chie back involves us very firmly grabbing a hold of Chie, which she might be into. Fight them yourself feels like I'm just leaping in and Chie will support me, clearly. Uh, uh, eh, eh, hold Chie back. Hold Chie back. It's the more, you know, respectful option here. What? Uh, what? Stop that! Chie seems angry. What a pain in the ass. Yo, that guy who ran away might call the cops. Screw this, let's go. Hey, hold on, wait! 
What the heck? Running away when you step in. Why'd you butt in? See, we're gonna butt in no matter what. The game fucked us here. What, you thought you couldn't leave it up to me? I could have handled them myself. Sorry. I charged in by myself. Caused you trouble. I'm used to it. It's no trouble. Just think next time. Hmm. I don't know, actually. I think using the word just is just... Eh, I hate it. I hate it. I feel like I'm used to it has some... Depending on the tone, I'm used to it. can be like, I'm used to it. Or it can be like, oh, I'm used to it. Ugh. It's no trouble. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, cool, cool. Jay looks apologetic. You're right, huh? I gotta remember I'm not alone. It's always like that. Everyone's doing their best. Then I start to worry that it's all up to me, and I've gotta work harder. I worry that someday I'll end up causing even more trouble like I did today. Ha 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 I'm so stupid. It seems Chie regrets her grandstanding. He felt Chie's quiet passion. Rank six, baby! Oh, sorry, rank seven! Rank seven, that's right! Kuabarakun, thank you. Um... Uh, never mind. I need to work harder, huh? Why am I moping? I'll think about it some. Though I'm not too smart. See you later! You walked home partway with Chie. Oh my god. Oh my god, Chie. Chie. All right. Ah, let's fucking crush this. Let's go. Your first term finals begins today and continue until the weekend. Until the weekend. Oh boy, oh boy. Let's go. Should hurry to school. All right. Access memory banks. Oh, finals, day one. Even further beyond. Ah, oh, what is morale? Ah, oh, easy, easy. Let's go. We got this, we got this. Feel you've chosen the correct answer. What sport is hike and die? Shit, I remember this, I remember this. It was balance beam. I'm pretty sure it was balance beam. Okay, two for two, maybe? Finals day two, oh. <sighs> You said even Kobo made mistakes in writing. Which kanji did he make a mistake on? No! Is it gonna be an image? No oh, shit! No! It's the top one. It has to be the top one. Oh, it's the top one. It has to be. It has to be. It's the top one. It's the top one. It has to be. Oh. To which period did Japan first implement bonus pay? The Meiji era. Yeah, the Meiji era, yes. Finals day three. Which king in a deck of cards is missing a mustache? King of hearts, just did this one. Nice. <sighs> okay, okay. Who said this? Man is but a reed, the most feeble thing in nature, but he is a thinking reed. Is that Pascal? Yes! Wait, wait. Yeah, it wasn't Nietzsche. Nietzsche was, that's something else. That's something else. Yeah, Pascal. Yep, yep, cool, cool. We're going strong here. Finals day four. Which one of these is the name of a real river? Hey, Peace Peace River, yeah. Or the Pee Pee River, yeah. What is the beginning of Gakuman no Susume a reference to? The Declaration of Independence. Chosen the right answer. I think we're doing this. I think we're doing this. I think we're actually doing this, y'all. Last day of exams. You answered every question with ease. Answer seems to be flowing from your hand. Oh! Oh shit! Oh shit! Let's go! Let's go! Oh. Oh. I'm so sleepy. All right. Yuck! Don't yawn in my face like that. 
<laughs> hey, for the third question on the English test, which phrase did you choose? Oh. Um. Oh, I went with used to. Oh. Oh no. Oh, wrong again. Oh, I'm sorry, Chie. So much for Chie going abroad. <laughs> Heck, why leave Inaba? You have so much right here. <laughs> Roasted. You're so annoying. Okay, everybody, everybody. Yo. Hey. No more encores. Oh. I mean, hi everyone. Hi everyone. Oh. Whoa, more losers? Oh shit. What do I need to know English for? I can always ask for a translator. How did you do, senpai? Uh, uh, my pen was on fire. I mean, I think we're just gonna just gonna flex on them here. I think my pen was on fire. You told me that you think it went well. Courage, yeah, nice. Wow, you're amazing. Oh. Ugh. Enough about the exams already. Yeah, Kanji's like, nah, let's let's be friends here, y'all. Come on. What's going on with the murder case? Hey, yeah. Hmm. Why don't we head to our special headquarters? We haven't been there in a while. Sure. Yeah. We decided to get together at the Juness Food Court. Oh, have we not been there with Risei yet? Mm, I'm kind of bummed. Aww. Not just because exams are over, but the whole thing with the police finding a suspect. Oh, I worry. Mean, we believe that only There'll we be more. solve this case. And now? Well, we still don't know yet. They haven't made an arrest. True, true. So, we gotta sit on our thumbs. Kinda. For now. Hey, Adachi! Spill the beans! Out loud. It's nice to have a suspect, but where the hell is he? Wait, wait. Wh where the hell is your suspect? We're at the end of our rope here. Oh, shit. You guys! Did, did you hear what I said? <laughs> uh, <laughs> this case is as good as solved. Oh, my God. Don't worry, kids. It's only a matter of time before we bring in the suspect. I mean, the guy's kidnapping people at random and slaughtering them. We won't rest until we bring him to justice. Holy shit, you're trying way too hard. I gotta get going. What were you even here for? Now, I'm really worried. Yeah, yeah. On the other hand, if the police have a search warrant out for the guy, we should stay out of it. Yeah. Yeah. Risei-chan, why don't you ask Yukiko to help you study? Yeah! Huh? Yeah. I guess, but wouldn't you rather ask a senpai of the opposite sex? Oh! Oh, Risei, stir up shit! Yes, I love Risei! Yes, stir the shit up! Yeah, 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 yeah. Senpai, I'm not a nuisance to you, am I? Uh, 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 Damn! Damn! This girl's dangerous. This is, yes, Chie! Yes, Chie, she's powerful! Holy shit! <laughs> well, let's change the subject. Well, whoa! Hey, any idea how Teddy's doing? Yeah, Teddy. We so want to talk about Teddy right now. Oh, yeah. I forgot to mention it to you. Mm-hmm. Check this out. What? Oh, my God. Wow. It's Teddy. <laughs> I let him stay at my place. In return, he's now our official store mascot. Brilliant, brilliant, Broske. That was a, that was a genius move. Ah, so he's hiding in plain sight. Reverse psychology, huh? Yeah. Man, he looks like one happy bear. Yeah. He kept saying that he didn't want to go back, so I made him a deal. Nice. Now, since I've got nothing better to do, I'm gonna go bug him. Mm. Ooh, I want to go too. <laughs> Can I feel his soft fur? Yes, absolutely. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's just us and Rise. Hey, senpai. Oh. Now that I'm getting the hang of school, I want to go out more and see the sights. But I tend to get recognized everywhere I go, so I'm a little nervous about going out on my own. She is so smooth. Holy shit. So fucking smooth. And you seem like the type of guy who knows all the cool spots in town. <laughs> uh, yeah, sure. I'll show you around. Yeah, for sure. Really? Woohoo! 
Sense Risei's natural, easy friendliness. You feel a faint bond formed between you and Risei. Here we go. Lovers, right? 100% lovers. Yep, yep. <laughs> of course. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed when creating personas of the lovers, Arcana. Yep. Makes sense. If you ever have some time to kill, think of me, okay? Okay, now, come yeah. Come on, let's go pester Teddy. Teddy, hey! Hey! <laughs> all right, all right. Yeah, this girl. This girl goes hard. Hey, everyone! They posted the test results! Let's fucking go! Let's go! Ah, uh, the awful moment of truth. Oh, well. Want to check it out? Hell yeah! Let's see what we get. We decided to check the test results. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. You got the highest score! Yes! Yeah! <laughs> oh my god! Yes! <laughs> Whoa! You're a genius, Kuwabara! That's awesome! I'm just as happy as if I got the highest grade myself! Your social link friends seem to be looking at you admiringly. You feel that you became closer to your school friends. All of them? Lunch break is almost over. You decided to return to class. Oh, we're popular now. Oh shit, we, we are popular. Head of the class achievement unlocked. Ah, we're finally free. Wow. All right. Hey, why don't Squat we go up. somewhere during summer vacation? Hell yeah. My motorcycle's back from the shop. Okay, okay. Hey, you guys I'm have down. motorcycles? Lucky you. Yeah. Your scooter's fixed? Yeah, it was sundered. How did they fix it? Yeah. I'm surprised they got it back together after Hanako Senpai, was it? Yep. <laughs> did something happen with Yosuke and Hanako san? Oh, yes. Let's build this story into more than it actually was. Definitely. He's striking out with the ladies and got his scooter busted up. <laughs> Whoa! Yosuke's after Hanako san? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> yeah. But let's, let's perpetuate this story. Yes. Uh, I'll back you up. <laughs> I wasn't talking about anything like that. I was saying we should go somewhere over summer vacation, like the beach. Yes. It'd be a pain to go by train, but a motorcycle. Ooh. Hmm. I haven't been to the beach in a long time either. Okay. The bright sun, the glistening waves, that luscious scent drifting from nearby stands, mm. the dripping of meat. Juices. Oh my god, Chie. Is food all you can think about? Food is amazing. Shut the fuck hey, up. Why don't we get our licenses too? It's just a written test, right? Sure. Yeah. We can't. We're too young. Aw, bullshit. Aw, oh, sorry, Kanji, but my birthday was last month, so I'm 16 now. Aw. Hey, that's cheating. <laughs> But sitting behind Senpai sounds great, too. Whoa. I want to squeeze in close. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let me remind you that it's against the law to have two people ride on a motorcycle. Ah. But I think it's a good idea for you guys to get your licenses. Sure. It takes about a week. Totally. It's supposed to be for work, but there's a scooter at the end. Ooh, that's a start. That's a start. We got one as a gift at the office that's just sitting around. I bet I could borrow it if I asked. I'd have to call my manager, though. Ooh, sure. Huh. Potentially dangerous. Is this actually working out? How about you, Chie? Yeah, Chie. A scooter, huh? Yeah. It can be any kind, as long as it's lower than 50 cc's. Yep. Then I might be in luck. Oh, shit! One of our relatives loves motorcycles. Maybe he has a scooter I can borrow. We're gonna all roll up in our scooters. This is gonna be the funniest shit. Wow, this might really happen. Let's all get our licenses and hit the beach together. <sighs> Wait, so is the game basically saying that once everyone gets their licenses, we unlock the beach episode? Hold up, what about Teddy? Aw, uh, fuck Teddy, who cares about Teddy? Hmm, if he doesn't move around, he could pass his luggage. 
Sure. Uh, it's stretching a little. <laughs> It'll be fine. If we can't get him on with one of us, we'll just strap on some wheels and tow him. <laughs> sure, sure. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> Teddy? <laughs> on wheels? <laughs> Roller skates? <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> I've made up my mind. I'm going to get my license. Nice. The beach, huh? I've gone before for pinup shoots, but it's been a while since I went for fun. Aww. Oh my gosh. Yeah, calm yourself, Yosuke. I already know what you're thinking. Just shut it. Does this mean <laughs> yeah. I'll get to see Reset herself in a swimsuit with my own two eyes? <laughs> well. Can you maybe not talk about her like she's not here? Yeah. Hey, who are you looking forward to seeing in a swimsuit, Senpai? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! In front of everyone! <laughs> based! Based! Holy shit! Based! <laughs> uh, I mean, I mean, I, 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 like, I mean, Chie is like the, the, you know, yeah. But, but, I mean, I mean, I mean, kanji, though. Kanji. Kanji. Absolutely. Kanji. No question. Oh! Oh, mine's nothing special. Crotch is thin and built for speed, so... <laughs> he just, he just goes straight with it. He's like, yeah, okay, I mean, well, mine's okay, you know. Hold it right there! <sighs> Why in the world are you interested in Kanji's swimsuit? Cut that out, damn it! What? Bruh! Anyway, Bruh. looks like we're set on going to the beach. Yeah. Yukiko, Chie, you guys should get your licenses too. Then you can ride motorcycles with us. Well then, let's do this! Let's do it. Yeah! Huh? Oh, yeah! <laughs> Hey, summer plans, baby. It seems you'll be going to the beach with everyone. It's raining tonight. Something may appear on TV. Hmm. <gasps> oh, shit. Wait, I recognize this person. Someone appeared. It's an extremely vivid image. A boy is standing with his back against a wall. <sighs> yeah, who was he? You all think you can see me? You all think you know everything about me? Oh shit. <laughs> then try and catch me. Oh shit, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's that? Yukiko? Hey, did you see that? Yeah. Who was that guy? I don't know him. Have you ever seen him on the news or some television special? Yeah, he hit on Yukiko. That's right, that's right. He seemed really gloomy. Like a zombie. Yosuke! Yosuke! <laughs> Teddy, calm down. All right already, I hear you. Sorry, I'm gonna give the phone to Ted. Sensei, it's me, Teddy! You don't have to yell. I finally got to see the Midnight Channel with my own eyes. Now I know exactly what's happening. What? What is it? That guy's suppressed emotions are resonating with the other side, which are picked up by the TVs over here. Okay. It's clear now that it's not being filmed by anyone. Mystery solved. I don't think we thought that it was ever being filmed by somebody. But that kid, he must already be inside the other world. What are we gonna do? Uh, we need a plan first. Gotcha! I knew I could count on you, Sensei! You can sense Teddy's strong trust in you. I think my heart skipped a beat. Oh. <laughs> Wait, that's just... That's just a rank up for Teddy? Just, just like that. Hell yeah, follow-up attack. Nice. That's enough, Ted. Give me the phone! <clears throat> hey... 
already inside. What happened to the blurry image that we usually see in advance? Yeah, something's different here. Something's very different. Because this could be the killer. This could be the killer. And did you hear what he said? Hmm. Try and catch me. Yeah. <sighs> now that I think about it, he looked like a high schooler. Hey, could he be? He might be. We'll see. Nah, I better not jump to conclusions. Yep. Let's meet up at headquarters tomorrow. All right? Later. Later. Yukiko? It's Chie. Oh. Oh, I finally got through. Yosuke's line was busy, <laughs> too. <laughs> I was just talking to Yukiko. Was that? Yep. Mm-hmm. You recapped your conversation with Yosuke and Teddy for her? Yeah. We gotta get to the bottom of this. Well, we better get some rest. Good night. Night. Yeah, the thick plottings, indeed. Decided to go to bed early. Well, shit. All right. All right before summer vacation starts. It's summer break starting today. You promised to meet up with your friends at the food court. You should hurry over to the food court. Okay, Risa and Teddy are checking out the other side. Okay. So we'll go ahead and start the meeting. Nice. Now about what happened last night. You guys all saw it, right? Yeah. Yeah. Shit he said made my blood boil. Mm -hmm. That mumbling of his... And those fish-like eyes pissed me off even more. Who the hell is he? That's the real question. Is he a victim or is he the killer? I don't know. I feel like this is one where we have all bets off. He's not necessarily a victim, but he's not necessarily the killer either. I feel like saying I don't know is the bitch answer. Like. I'm gonna go with victim. Under normal circumstances, I'd agree. But when I noticed how clear the image was on TV, I knew something was different. Yeah, but there's so no I way he's the Chie, killer. And while we were talking, it hit me. Maybe that boy is the culprit. <sighs> no, no, no. It's just a hunch, but it makes sense. It's a decent hunch, but no. We've been told the suspect is a high schooler. The police are after him for the murder of King Moron. It kind of fits, but no. So to see that on TV last night, at a time like this? Mm. I mean, he even taunted the viewers, saying, try and catch me. Yeah, but that could be his own shadow or something like that. Uh, so? Yeah. All right. Let's say there's this high school student. We'll call him Shin. Okay. For some random reason, who knows why, Shin is able to enter the other world. Right. Then Shin, again for some random reason, starts throwing people into that world intending to kill them. The police can't prove the other world exists, so it's the perfect crime. He can't possibly be caught. Uh huh. Now, imagine you're Shin, but after a while, people stop dying when you throw them in the TV. You don't know why. Right. You want to kill King Moron, but the TV is out, so you have to do it personally. Now the police are on to you. Oh. As a result, you, I mean Shin, is a wanted criminal, and there's no place for him to run. So, you're saying he went into the other world to dodge the cops? Maybe? Oh, so that's why he said, catch me if you can. <laughs> wow, senpai. You're smarter than you look. Jeez, you could piss me off sometimes. We still don't know why he targeted people who were shown on TV. Yeah. But if he had a personal grudge against Mr. Moraoka, that explains one thing. With a strong enough motive, wouldn't he forsake the untraceable TV method and try to kill Mr. Moraoka on his own? If you think about it that way, it sort of makes sense why Mr. Moraoka died without appearing on TV. But I wonder what that boy's going to do now that he's in there. Hmm. With Teddy on this side, there's no way for him to get out. Yeah. You don't think he's gonna get desperate and end it all? I mean, there was that room with the chair and everything. He did look depressed. Like it was the end of the world. No, I don't think that's it. 
The killer has to know that the people he threw into the TV have come back to this side. Sure. I can see missing Yukiko or Kanji, but Rise, a celebrity? There's no way the killer wouldn't know she's still alive. Yeah. So that means he knows there's a way out of the TV world. As for the rest, we'll just have to ask him face to face. Sure. Let's go. Hey, good timing. How did it go? Not good. Not good. There's not enough information to go on. But at least we're positive that someone's in there. I see. Wait, where's Teddy? He's still looking. Okay. All right. So we need to find out who that guy is. Yeah. And if he is, in fact, the one the police are after. Once we figure that out, we just do our thing. Hell yeah. That's right. If he really is the killer and he's escaped into the other world, the police don't have a chance of catching him. True, true. So it's all on us. Everyone's heart was united by the desire to solve the case. Investigation team rank up. Hell yeah. Well then, let's get digging. All right. Seems that you'll need more information on that boy to make any progress. You should ask around about it. Well, shit, this part. This is my totally favorite part in the game. <laughs> Arachi. <sighs> I think I'll stay here a little longer before I go out again. Hmm? Ah, you startled me. Don't sneak up on me like that. Eh? What was I doing? Oh, uh, you know, investigating. I'll tell Dojima. Dojima-san, maybe say anything about it? Just keep this a secret from him, please. Wait, what? Clues to catch the suspect? If I tell you, will you keep quiet? Okay then. I'm just talking to myself here, but... He supposedly had a part-time job in the shopping district. Where was it? Well, I don't think they told me that much. Seems that Adachi's purposefully leaked some information. Where exactly did the suspicious boy work? Hmm. It's Sozai Dagaku. You asked if a student was working here part-time. Well, where'd you hear that from? I told him not to tell anyone. Anyway, yes, he did work here for a short time. But this was a while ago. I had him cutting the meat, but he got bored with the work very quickly. Hmm. I remember he had black eyes. And what else? Oh yeah, he said the person who worked here before him was the, his classmate during middle school. I see that kid, his classmate around here sometimes. Maybe you should talk to him but when you see him. I don't know if you'll find him today, but he recently dyed his hair golden brown, so he should be easy to spot. He obtained a bleed about the boy. If you can find his golden brown haired classmate, he'll probably obtain information about the boy. Ah, uh, here we go. Huh? You want to see my yearbook? Oh, are you looking for him? You want to see his picture? <laughs> you do, don't you? Well, today's your lucky day because me and my friend are going around showing it to everyone. Want a copy? Tame the boy's picture. There's no doubt that the boy in the picture is the one you saw on the Midnight Channel. A name is written below the picture. Mitsuo Kubo. So this is the suspicious boy's name. You should report to Rise. Man, the culprit's a kid? I don't think it's the culprit. I can't even imagine what it's like for a kid my age to kill someone. I'd be scared if you could. Some people are just like that, though. It's true what they say. It takes all types to make a world. Haha, <laughs> you sound like you speak from experience. It pisses me off that we gotta go in and rescue a bastard like that. But we can't just let him die, I guess. Let's get him out before the fog sets in. There's a lot we need to ask him. Yeah, his motives, the method he used, all that stuff. There's too much we still don't know. Showed the picture of Mitsuo Kubo to the others. That's him, all right. It's definitely the guy on the Midnight Channel. Yep. It's settled then. He is the killer. And he's in here now. This guy came to our shop before. Oh, he did. Okay. Was he spying on me? Shit. Oh my god, I really was being targeted. Damn, maybe it is him. Damn it! Freaking punk! Hey, I've seen him before too. Hmm. When? Oh, now I remember. Yukiko, it's that one guy! Yeah, the one guy that flirted with her, yeah. That one guy? 
<laughs> of course, for you, Kyoshi, like, huh? Back in April, remember? He uh. suddenly came and started hitting on you? Yeah. Oh, him! The dude who got served by Yukiko in front of the school. Mm hmm Man, Chie, how'd you remember something like that? <laughs> well, that was the first time he talked to her, but I remember he was always following her around. Oh, shit, really? Um, sorry, who are we talking about? <laughs> the dude who came right up to you at the school gates and called you Yuki? Yeah. Oh. Um... Uh, Really? <laughs> she doesn't remember at all. Wait, did he kidnap Yukiko to get back at her for rejecting him? No, no, see, this is why. It all falls apart pretty quickly. Um, I didn't really reject him. He came up to me while I was busy working and asked, Don't the biker gangs bother you? Hmm. Just Odd going question. on and on about how biker gangs can't do anything unless they're in a pack and stuff. See, it sounds more like this is like a lonely incel character that's getting misinterpreted as potentially being the culprit. He seemed to be the type who just keeps talking whether you like it or not, if that makes sense. Hmm, yeah. Was that why I was kidnapped? No, no, this all doesn't fit at all. Huh? Wait, I I'm not a biker. Ugh, a damn special report. So that's why I got dragged into this. You know, I heard he's been saying stuff about that announcer's affair, too. Lots of muttering about how women who cheat on their husbands should be executed. Whoa. Okay, so yeah, definitely incel behavior. Yep. Sounds like it's all coming together. Well, it's time for a showdown. All right. Can you tell where this Mitsuo guy's at? Yeah. I'll give it a try. Just a sec. Whoa. She's literally using Cerebro. Yeah, I found him. He's that way. Okay. Got him. All right, let's go! We're so close to the killer. We can't lose him now. <sighs> All right. Whoa, whoa! Whoa! Oh, this is so cool! What is this? Some kind of game? Oh my god, this is awesome! Well, he did taunt us, saying try and catch me. I guess he thinks of all this as a game. Oh my god, this is so cool! Oh, this pisses me off! I hereby sentence him to a hundred kicks to the face! Alright, I will help you deliver those kicks, G8. Let's go! Let the games begin. We gotta reach the ending. Man, this is old school! <laughs> We gotta reach the ending! Gotta admit, all guys love games. And all girls love Teddy. <laughs> and they all walked on without him. You have pinpointed Mitsuo Kubo's location. All that's left is to reach him where he's waiting. You should prepare yourselves to find and apprehend him. Yikes. Oh. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. You sense an intensely terrifying presence. Open this box. Do I need to prepare my anus? Well, shit, here we go, here we go. What's this? I have a really bad feeling about this. You shouldn't open that. You got that, senpai? Don't ever open that. Fuck it. Something jumped out of the box. What is this thing? It feels really bad. This is a boss. This is just straight up a boss. Here goes Persona! Hell no! Kanji's injured! Come on, suck it up! No. You can go, Senpai, no! Someone heal her! Um. Okay, I'll look for an opening. Look for an opening? What do you mean, look for an opening? What the fuck? I want to go home! 
Where is go home? You can't use go homes in here? That's actually good damage, though. We could solo him. Best girl and I will take you on. Holy shit! No way we can daze him. Go off. Get fucked. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We're gonna juice the fuck out of MC Kun right now. Just hang on. I'll find you no Well, this is fine. Samagawa Riverbank. You wandered here with a pensive Yosuke. Yosuke is holding something. I found this. It's a print club sticker I took with Saki-senpai. When I first got here, she insisted on taking it. Back then, somewhere inside me, I thought I was above this place. A lot of people saw me as the enemy because Juness was going to ruin the shopping district. But when I met her, she told me, Parents are parents. You're you. Even if she didn't really mean it, it made me happy. Because of her, I started to think maybe this town wasn't all that bad. But then... Why? Why did she have to die? It pisses me off. It makes me mad. I wanted to talk with her more. I wanted to get to know her better. But she's not here anymore. Yosuke is sobbing out loud. I'm, I'm starting to feel the, the heat come on here. Might be just this sweater, but... Ooh. Kuwabara. I get it now. I wanted to forget about Saki-senpai. How she's not here anymore. I wanted to forget that I was living a boring life in the middle of nowhere. When the murders started, I got excited. I thought there was finally a point to me being in Inaba. I thought I could forget Senpai was gone. And the fact that I was such a loser. I jumped at the murders and never once thought about what I was doing. I didn't even take the first step. I'm sorry, Saki Senpai. I'm sorry, Kuwabara. <sighs> I understand. I didn't care if she didn't like me. I just wanted her to smile. Yosuke is still crying a little. But I think I'm awake now. I need to get over the fact that Saki-senpai isn't coming back. That when this case ends, I'll have nowhere to run. And I won't have changed. You made me realize that. Oh, getting voice acting here. It seems you are able to act as Yosuke's crutch. You feel a bond between you and Yosuke. Oh. Hmm. 
My. Oh, you don't happen to be the hospital janitor. Oh, that's right. Hmm. My, I didn't think I would see you here. It's a nice day today. Would you take the time to talk with this old woman? Yeah. Goodness, I am so happy. Aw. The old lady smiles gently. Hmm. Good day. Um. You introduce yourself. Kuabara Kurimi. Kuabara Chen, is it? <laughs> A lovely name. It suits you. I've lived here all my life, but I don't know you. Oh, I just moved here. Is that so? Oh, if you're from the city, you may think it's a bit inconvenient here. But I think it's a nice town. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice to hear. It's good to hear pleasant things about your home. My, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. I haven't introduced myself. My name is Hisano Kuroda. Oh, okay. I am Death. Go on. What do you mean? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm saying foolish things. Kuabara-chan, you're still not used to this town, are you? If you ever have any problems, I can give you some advice. <laughs> Though I'm sure you'd rather spend your time with younger ladies. She seemed to be a kindly old woman, even though she called herself Death. So she's clearly the Death Arcana social link, right? You've become acquaintances with Hisano Kuroda. Yep. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed when creating Personas of the Death Arcana. I hope we can meet again. Goodbye now. Be careful now. He left Isano and went home. Well, okay. Central Shopping District in front of Chinese Diner Aya. You finished today's training and decided to stop by with Chie. Today is steak bowl day! Just you wait! Oh! Me time! I don't time. have any more. Have any more what? Don't oh. tell me they're at it again! Alright, let's stop the bullies. Let's go! Hell yeah. Let's go. It's the same what are you trio. Up to? Huh? Aw, oh, not her again. Yep. And me. <laughs> I know how to handle this bitch. Oh shit. <laughs> you look like you got something planned. Help! Hear that, Chie Chan? He wants help. How do you know my name? Yeah. We ran into the guy you saved last time. Mm -hmm. Had a friendly conversation. Takashi. He told us all kinds of stuff. Like where you live and about that precious Yukiko-san of yours. Oh, no, you did not. What are you trying to pull? Oh, I'm just gonna have a little chat with this kid. Stay put, okay? Cause who knows what'll happen to Yukiko-san if you get in our way. Ah, <laughs> man, that's nasty. Hmm. Why you? <laughs> Things aren't looking good. Hmm. Fight with Chie. Let Chie do her thing. I think we fight with her. Yeah. Yeah. We can't let these guys get away. Yeah. She is spitting mad. You sure about that? So you don't care what happens to your loved ones? Uh, fine. 
Then hit me. You're pissed at me, right? Then why don't you just take a swing at me? Oh shit, GA, let's go. I won't fight back. Be my guest. <laughs> the face, the gut, just pick a target. As hard as you want. Holy shit. Come on. <laughs> She's like, who's the bitch now? <laughs> yeah, you're scared, Freak. aren't you? Yeah. What's with this bitch? She for real? Whatever, man. Let's go. Holy shit. She stared him down. I was like, come on. Make a move. Make a move. Come on. Take the first shot. See what happens. Let's see. Come on. <laughs> Miss, thank you. Oh. <sighs> She's like, my heart rate was going crazy right there. Huh? Oh, no. Don't worry about it. Oh. The child ran off. <sighs> my heart's still pounding. Mm. <laughs> was that stupid of me? No, that was fucking awesome. You protected that kid. Thanks. Oh. It seems Chie is embarrassed. It might have been stupid, but I wanted to save them. Yeah. That kid, Yukiko. Oh. How I feel about this isn't fake. I really want to protect them. Oh. Chie is smiling gently. You feel your relationship with Chie has grown yet deeper. Oh, shit. Rank nine. Um, well. Well, what? I also want to protect you. Oh. I might be a little flaky, and maybe you don't even need protecting. But I... Oh, this is sweet. I want to protect you. Oh. <laughs> the mood is right. Oh, my heart. What should you do? Will you be my girlfriend? Oh, this is so fucking cute. Huh? Yeah, yeah. Um, um... <gasps> oh! Okay. Yeah. You sure? This is me we're talking about. I'm sure, Chie. Chie is blushing. Oh, sweet. There's no turning back. Your relationship with Chie has become intimate. Let's go! Let's go! Yeah! Oh! Then? Achievement unlocked a special lady. Oh, this, this is embarrassing. Oh. You spent a long while with Chie. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Begin a new quest. End your quest. Wait. What? Please enter your name. Huh? What is this? Please enter your name. Me. Su oh. Oh. Does this mean the game's starting? Uh, this kind of pisses me off. Let's go, senpai. Oh my god. Look at him. Look at him. What is this abomination? Teddy, what are you? <laughs> All right. Hmm? Weird, there's a dead end up ahead. I thought this was the right way. Hmm. Whack. Hmm. Oh. Huh? What happened? You ended up somewhere else. Be careful, senpai. Oh, okay. Well, we still have the map, so we're good. All right, now we just go home and we'll do this tomorrow. Female announcer draws near. Command, fight, run. Mitsuo attacks. Thou hast done well in defeating the female announcer. Oh shit, Mitsuo hath been promoted to the next level. Thy excitement increases by four. Thy emptiness increases by one. Whoa, shit. 
can't be. Does he mean murdering people is just a game for him? He's so on my enemies list. You oh shit, well okay. I mean, that's, that's pretty damning right there. No, 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 no. stand against me for being a rotten orange Oroka draws near command kill run kill kill Mitsuo attacks Mitsuo hath been promoted to the next level thy attention increased by 16 thy fame increases by 17 thy coolness increases by 3 what's with this all this about attention and fame I can't believe this what makes him think this is cool Let's hurry, senpai. We gotta catch this sick bastard. I feel like I'm gonna be going through the recording of it. Oh, big guy. And like trying to deduce what I can from all this, from all this stuff here. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, be careful. Light's no good on this one. Adam Smasher. Here we go. Boom! Get out of here! Amazing, you're doing well. <laughs> oh my god. Boom! <laughs> We're too fucking powerful! Turn off the cheat scale. <laughs> Alright. Ah, the hero Mitsuo. Thou hast done well. Your. Your. Kill, 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 kill. Open the door and enter. The door is sealed with mysterious power. Pitch black darkness flows from the orb of darkness. And now we can enter. Cool. All right, squad. Look, there he is. So what's going on? You Mitsuo, you better be ready to pay, you bastard. Oh shit. So is his shadow saying all these things and his shadow wanted them to die? Wait, Kanji, something's not right. Yeah, he's a victim. Everyone gets on my nerves. That's why I did it. Oh, he did do it. What do you think of that? Say something, damn it. <sighs> Nobody even thought of me after the first two people. That's why I went for the third one. Well, shit. I killed them. Well, shit, here we go. What are you all quiet for? Yeah, yeah, why is it all quiet? Because I feel nothing. Oh. What are you talking about? Make sense, damn it! What the? Well, which one's the shadow? Well, the one glowing, duh. I have nothing. I am nothing. Me. Well. What? What's that supposed to mean? I'm. I'm not nothing! <laughs> nice, he's not saying it! No, if this keeps up. <laughs> who are you guys? How'd you get in here? Damn it, who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Shut the hell up. We came after you. Are you the killer? <laughs> uh, this is the attention he wanted. <laughs> of course I am. I'm the one behind everything. I don't give a damn what this imposter's saying. <laughs> you hear that? You have nothing to do with me. Get out of my sight. Well, <sighs> uh, you shouldn't have said that goes for the rest of you too why'd you chase me all the way here oh wait it's not huh i'll kill you i'll kill all of you i can do it you know i can do anything so you don't 
Yeah, there it is. There it is. What the? Shit. Ah! Oh. Oh, shit. Damn it. Here we go again. Get ready, everyone. Once we beat him, this case is as good as closed. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, man child. Yes, yes. Character setup. Oh, cool. Oh, this is so cool. It's all jaggy and blocky. Yeah. Is that thing supposed to be a game character? Jeez, how insulting can he get? You'll have to destroy the outer shell first. All right, all right, they're phases, let's go. So let's attack regularly, see what it is. Basic physical, okay, it's good. Let's try ice. Ice is fair, okay. Oh, that's so cool. Big heal for Teddy. Okay. Here's our chance. Let's go. Let's do it. Yeah, yeah. No. Okay. Hey, are we lightning? Oh no! Literally. Oh, we came in with the wrong cop. We literally came in with the wrong cop. Yeah, this is just this is just a really bad combo here. Yikes, Teddy! Someone heal him. Whisper. Oh, it's weaker though. The shell takes time to finish forming. Oh. Destroy it before that happens. Okay, okay. Senpai, this is, you're low on health. This is good Be info, careful. though. This is good info. Yikes, Teddy! Someone heal him! <gasps> yep, did like nothing. No, don't get scared. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Is that a white? Yusuke Senpai is injured. This is bad. It has an auto kill AOE combo. All right, so let's see Here goes. our boy's big, big physical hit. 112, it's not bad, not bad. Here goes. I kind of want to bait him to attack. Um, oh, fuck, he got all four. 220. Holy shit! Holy shit! My boy Kanji just absolutely carrying, though. Look at that damage! Just a regular attack? White Wall? He changed up his strategy. Yukiko Senpai's dizzy. Hmm. Here goes. All right, that's a little weak. Now he's shooting ice. Yukiko Senpai needs help. What the help. hell? No! I'll finish you. Let's go. Let's go. Damage. Let's go. Full damage. Oh shit! Let's attack with all our strength. Ready? That was the right call. Hell yeah. Here, here goes. Persona. This is the big gamble here. I, I will oh. That's why 
The ailment successfully reverted. Prayer. Okay, so that's a full a full reset of the, uh, the guy here. Needs to have leveled up. Oh, that did nothing. That did actually. That did yeah. That did jack. Ha! Miss. Hell yeah. No. 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 You ain't doing shit. You're done. You're done. Get the fuck out of my town. Oh, 400 damage. How did I play without Kanji? Look at this. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. He's stronger than we are. Bruh. Bruh. Give up. It's over. It's over! You're done! You're done! I am done. Boom! Alright, and Kanji, you carried the whole thing on your back. End it all right here! Send it, buddy! Woo! We can smash it off! Aunt Dan's ready! Who needs healing? Who needs healing? Kanji! Oh my god! Wow. Uh, All right, Mitsuo. It's over. Finally awake, huh? You've been a major pain in our ass. Yeah. What the? You guys. Who the hell are you guys? What do you mean, who the hell are we? We came to talk to you. Talk to me? Yeah. The police are after you. They think you're the one who killed King Moron and the other two. So, are you the killer? Is he? All the cases, all on me. <laughs> That's right, I did it. <sighs> he didn't do it. He didn't do it. He wants attention. He's doing this to get attention. Yeah, yeah, no, he didn't do it at all. There's you no way. piece of shit. There's no way. And not just that bastard Moraoka. That stupid announcer, and the Konishi bitch, too! I killed all of them! It was all me! See, because he doesn't know about the other ones that were that were targeted. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where'd it go? Oh, maybe he did do it. Maybe he just accepted it. Wait, wait, no, no. No, it would have a conversation then. What's going on? Hmm... <laughs> it's gone. Yeah. Freaking monster disappeared. Yeah, he definitely didn't do it. Take that, son of a bitch. <sighs> hey. He's exhausted. We need to hurry and get him out of here. Yeah. Oh, let's interrogate him right here in the Juness Electronics Department. Yeah. Can't you tell? Yeah. Why am I here? What the hell are you guys? Oh, is he like, is he a shut-in? So he doesn't really, no, because he goes to another school. So he's definitely not a shut-in. Stop it. Why did the TV? <sighs> okay, we really need to interview this guy. Hey. Yeah. You seem confused from everything that happened. Yeah. We have a bunch of questions for you. Way to go, Teddy. Be on it right now. First off, why did you do all this? Answer in ten words or less. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Is that a costume? <laughs> what a loser. Get out of my face, you freak. F freak and He's deflecting, too. Hold it, Teddy. You're not helping. Yeah. Hmm. Did you really do it? Get off my back. I already told you. I did it. Hmm. Why? How could you do such a thing? I don't thing? believe it. Three people are dead because of you. Ha. <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> well, this is sad and sick, but... Everyone's talking about it, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna be a big deal, yeah. It's a huge yep, deal. Yep, yep. And I did it. Yep. All of it. All by myself. Now, it'd be really cool if he was involved in it in some way, but he didn't actually do it. You just wanted the attention? Yeah. Then why did you target me and the others? How did you kidnap us? <sighs> Dang it, Yukiko, you shouldn't have said that. You shouldn't have said that. <sighs> yeah, he doesn't have an answer to that because he doesn't know what you're talking about. Whoa. Yeah, he is. doesn't know. <laughs> hey, Yuki. After all this time, now you want to talk to me? <laughs> what bullshit. Answer me. If you held a grudge against me, that's fine. But why the others? Oh, yeah. Now get him on not knowing which ones the others are. <laughs> yeah, but he doesn't care. He's fixated on Yukiko. Yeah. You're so desperate, it hurts. I didn't care who I attacked. Everyone pisses me off. You what? You gotta be kidding me. You killed Senpai over nothing? You son of a bitch! I hope you're ready to get what's coming to you. <laughs> Kanji is serious. What, are you gonna kill me? No. Kanji-kun? <laughs> kill you? It ain't gonna be that easy, you piece of shit. What you did can never be taken back. Yeah. No. You're gonna own up to your crimes and pay for what you did. Yeah, yeah. You ain't gonna be allowed to kick the bucket until you understand exactly what it is you've done. <sighs> Why, damn it! Why does she have to die because of this bastard? Holy shit, you, Yosuke's voice actor's killing it right now. <sighs> Dude, the cops. Yeah. Let's go get him. Huh? Get the cops. What are you waiting for? Call the damn police! Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Yosuke. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, this is huge. Okay, Dojima, don't be mad, but we found your suspect for you. We just stumbled across him while we were hanging out at Juness. How about that? At least that? the Dachi-san yeah. seemed happy. <laughs> yeah. Well, I guess this means our work is done. Hmm, we'll see. We'll see about that. He did it all to draw attention. Ugh, I can't get my head around that. It's just wrong. There's no way, there's no way he's either the one that did all of this or the one that did, like, the majority of this. I'm guessing, I'm guessing that at the very least, sorry, no. At the most, at the most, all Mitsuo did was uh, either become the copycat, the theory I had about a copycat, or he's done like, like nothing, like absolutely nothing. I mean, not that it would have been okay if he'd had a better reason. I know, don't worry. It's finally over. Let's leave the rest to the police. Mm -hmm. My world will be peaceful again now. Ah, Teddy. Oh, that's a good point. Things in the in the TV world will probably give us some implications and some some understanding as to one, if it actually was just Mitsuo. Two, if there was maybe someone manipulating or controlling Mitsuo. Three, if it's just someone else. Or four. If it's like, if it's like something to do with the mystical side of things with shadows and shit, but yeah, Teddy will actually be very important for the next like period of time. Yeah, I'm happy for you. We really went through a lot. I like scoring with guys. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Teddy. Oh, come on, will you ever let it go? <laughs> what? Scoring with guys? <laughs> you, you don't need to know the details. 
I'm sure you'd like us to forget the sauna incident too, right, Kanji-kun? Uh, w well, well. That's not fair. I wanted to see everyone else's too. <laughs> That's right. We three are the only ones who saw everyone's secret. Yeah. Hey, so what was Yoshi's like? Come on, it's about time you told us. <laughs> uh, it's pretty much like the rest. Come on, let's leave it at that. Yeah. I got you, buddy. I got you. Speaking of which, nothing really happened in your case, huh? Really? Hmm. Wait, really? Is there something special about Senpai after all? Hmm. Ours is clearly being saved for something then. Hmm. Sensei is the man. Or we're such a nothing character that we don't have a, a, a setup there, yeah. And now that the case is solved, we won't be calling you leader anymore, will we? Oh, you just call me friend. Oh yeah, it's kind of sad. Oh no, we'll have reasons to hang out, guys. Come on, it's literally hey, summertime. Why don't we have a celebration. Yeah, Rise, let's go. We always have a rap party after we're done shooting. It's fun and it'll help give us some closure. Let's go, let's go. Ooh, a party, that sounds great. Let's go all out. Oh, oh, I wanna go to Yuki-chan's house. Gorgeous dinner, hot springs, table tennis, yukata, geisha, Fujiyama, full witness. What the fuck? <laughs> what is he talking about? You're right. Yukiko Senpai's family runs a hot springs in. Oh my god. A hot springs episode. A hot spring that Yukiko Senpai bathes in too? Oh my god. Hey, keep it to yourself. You're sounding like a creep. Yosuke, you are literally like the second worst person to make mention of that here. Well, it sounds like fun, but I don't think it's possible today. Yeah, it's summer vacation. All the rooms must be occupied. We can't do a sleepover? We'll figure it out. Maybe next time. I promise. Yeah, we'll figure something out. Hey, why don't we hit your place instead? <laughs> Did you see the heart above Teddy? Teddy's like, Teddy will remember this. <laughs> oh, My place. But will your uncle get suspicious? Like, why are you all celebrating? No, no. You mind if Nanako is there? Yeah. Why would we leave her out? The more the merrier. Yeah. Cool. Oh yeah. If your uncle's a detective, he might not come home tonight. Mm hmm Nanako-chan might be getting hungry. Let's all go! Just give Nanako some love! Hey, then why don't we make dinner together? Oh my god. Yes. Wow. Are you good at cooking, Senpai? No, 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 no. We it's the it's the it's the we assumed we, you know, no. Well, sort of? No, 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 it's okay, it's okay. What are you saying? <laughs> Did you already forget the tragedy of the school camp out? Yeah. Well, we already told you that was an accident. She's right, we just got a couple of the ingredients wrong. Guys, please don't do this. I'm begging you, I don't need another trauma to deal with. Hey, I'm a good cook too. Oh, Rise, actually I'll a good cook? I'll make something for you, senpai. Oh, but for everybody, though. Ta-da! Teddy has a great idea. Let's have a cooking battle. The winner will be crowned Iron Cook Inaba. Oh, my God. Yes. A cooking battle? Now I'm even more worried. No, that's a genius idea, Teddy. Let's go, Teddy. Sure, that sounds like fun. <laughs> Aw, but I'll win hands down. Ah! Sure you want to make it that easy? Ah! Rise, just be like... <laughs> Dude, listen to me. For the sake of our stomachs, you have to cook something too. I will. Help us, partner. You're our only hope. Oh, I call this partner our creamy partner. Then you can represent the guys team. Mm. Nanako-chan will be our judge. Hell yeah. All right. All right. So we got the ladies and the guys... Versus. I can be uh, a taster too. Okay, okay. Teddy can be a tester too. At the end, you're supposed to say that was delicious, right? If it's good. Woohoo! I'm getting all fired up! All right, let us advance for 
north into the grocery section downstairs. Charge! Don't worry, we will protect Nanako Chan. We promise, sir. I won't let that. I won't let them feed uh, Nanako any kind of toxic sludge. We decided to call Nanako to tell her about the cooking competition. Hello, Dojima residents. Oh, hi. Yeah, he said he's gonna be late today. Okay. Huh? Dinner? You're all going to cook? Ask Nanako Chan what she wants for dinner. Yeah. What do you want? What do I want? Yeah. Oh. She's just being modest. Ask her again. Yeah. Well, um, an omelet. Oh, we're gonna make her one of those little omelets with the, the smiley face of ketchup. Yeah, yeah. I wanna eat omelet with fried rice. Classic, okay. Perfect for a cooking okay. competition, too. I'll be waiting. You ended the phone call. Nanako seems to be looking forward to it. Fried rice omelet, an excellent choice, Nanako-chan. Yeah, With omelet rice. that simple, I doubt we'll get a second helping of Mystery Food X. You'd be surprised. You'd be surprised. You can really fuck up rice. Huh? What's wrong? What? N nothing. All right, let's go get our ingredients. <laughs> the boys are like, uh, I don't know. What do uh, I? If they're all making the same thing, why are they splitting up to different parts of the market? Mm. Well, some of them are going to the egg section, some are going to the rice section, and some of them are going to just buy ketchup. Looks like you'll need all the help I can give you. Yeah. Hey, what kind of omelet are you making? I'll go get the ingredients for you. What kind of omelet should you make? I think we go Orthodox or Asian American. I think we go Orthodox. Yeah. I gave Yosuke a list of ingredients you'll need. Everyone brought their basic ingredients to the cart. Foie gras? Who put foie gras in there, Yukiko? Quite an eye you got there, senpai. Oh, wait, Rise. It's a must-have for my special omelet. Ah, she's rich. She eats, um... Don't worry, yeah, I'll let you have a things. taste. Ooh, or maybe I could spoon-feed you. <laughs> I heard last time you choked down something so awful that words couldn't describe it. It was horrible. <laughs> you poor dears. Who would do such a horrible thing? <laughs> Rise-san. Rise-san? the only chance you get to gloat. Is that clear? <laughs> I'll crush you with one strike. Oh my. Whoa. You guys look like you're ready to enter the ultimate frying championship. My man, he just went there, grabbed either a soda or a ketchup. I can't tell which it is. And he's just like, yep. Kanji kun, that's alcohol. Oh, oh, never mind. It's alcohol. Uh, oh, it, <laughs> <laughs> it immediately walked the way, back. Where's Teddy? <laughs> where is Teddy? Miss, am I allowed to eat this? Where are you? Where are you? Of course you can, dear. Eat as much as you like. Aww. You're such a nice lady. Is this one cooked already? Aw, it's samples. That's nice. <laughs> this one's ready, too. Oh, my. Are you hungry for more? Aww. Here, I'll open this one, too. You're so beautiful. Wow, Teddy's about to have a social link unlock right about now. Oh, my. No. No, I mustn't. I've got a husband and a son. Wait, wait. Wait, what were you considering, sample tray lady? But I really want this meat, and I want you to cook it, miss. I, I know that he might have some game. Oh, I couldn't possibly. The manager would get so upset. I'm gonna knock the stuffing out of that bear. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, this is amazing. Risei Chan was right. This celebration does make me feel like it's over. Oh, this is so perfect. The case really has come to an end. Oh. <sighs> 
<laughs> Who are you? <laughs> yeah. Wow, it's really Risa Chan. <gasps> oh, right, she's a fan. I should go back over there soon. <laughs> are you going somewhere? Oh. Uh, Teddy? Yep. The guys kept their promise. Teddy, don't you tell her anything. Don't you tell her anything. A promise. What if you made a promise with me? Could you stay then? Oh. A promise with Nana-chan? Um, a promise that you'll play with me. How about that? Oh, how about that? A friend, yeah. Sensei, you kept your promise with me. So I should go back over there. No. No. Don't worry about it. But a promise is a promise. It's not good to break them. You promised Nanako. Sensei. Oh. I promise with Nana-chan. I made a promise to play with her. Can I really stay here? Well, not literally here, but... It wasn't just yeah. my promise. Nana-chan made it with me. I'm really, really happy. Thank you. Aww. Teddy's eyes are watering. Aww. Yosuke, I have a new promise to keep. So I want to stay here a little longer. Is that okay with you, sir? Hmm. Huh? What are you talking about? You're not going anywhere. Yeah. You can't just quit your job like that. In any case, if you left, it's ready. Oh Come shit! Out of the way, senpai. Whoa! Ow! <laughs> Presentation. Bon appetit. Oh. Well, well, wait a sec. Wait. Yeah, wait a sec. What's going on here? Asking Nanako-chan to jump in and try these for us is kind of unethical. Uh, not, not, Don't not, look at us like that. Not really. Oh, so it's uh, our job to taste it first and make sure we can keep it down. <laughs> hey, that's mean. No, it's then being safe. Then try mine first, Yosuke-senpai. It's guaranteed delicious. You don't mind me going first? Actually, I've been looking forward to yours. Okay, okay. I mean, Rizette cooked it herself. Can you imagine how many guys would kill me if they found out? Just chill out and eat it. Well then, chow time! How is it? <laughs> oh no! No, are you messing with us, Yosuke? I, I can't give this to Nanako-chan. Rize talks such a big game, and it's garbage? Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, it's so delicious that you won't let anyone else have a bite? Oh, no. These women are hopeless. In any case, you should try eating it, too. Ugh. It's spicy. The spiciness and heat are like lava in your mouth. You can't taste or feel the foie gras at all. It's starting to taste like iron. For some reason, you sense a dull pain in your mouth as well. Am I bleeding? Is my mouth bleeding? You can't give this to Nanako. Ugh. Here, try mine next. Oh, God. I'll take this one. Yeah, Kanji, you got this. K Kanji, that's a lot. Two. Hey, say something. Yukiko leveled up her cooking? Well, uh... How do I put this? Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> it tastes really, um, boneless. Boneless? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> what? That's not a word you use to describe taste. Does it taste good or not? Tell me. Oh, God. What does it taste like? It doesn't seem to be dangerous. But you don't sense any flavors in particular. 
In fact, you don't taste anything at all. You can't even taste the ingredients. Oh no! Chat! We've got the Rona! We can't taste it! Oh shit! Oh no! <laughs> Not good, uh, that's for sure. It tastes like... Like I'm eating plain oatmeal. I kinda, I kinda understand that vibe. Basically, she boiled rice, and she was so scared of making it taste disgusting that she inerted all flavor. It's pretty impressive that you put so many ingredients into a dish and it came out tasting like nothing. Your palate just isn't refined enough. Oh. No, not a go! No! I think it tastes good. Oh. Oh, you're sweet. You are precious. Nanako-chan. Oh, you are precious. Okay. Try my next. Yours is going to be salty as fuck, Chie. I can already tell. Uh, I don't know about this, but I think it'll taste good. This okay. time for sure. 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 She put meat in it. It was a rice omelet, but she put meat in it. I'll give it a whirl. Okay. How is it? Wow! This tastes awful! <laughs> you have to try this, Yosuke! <laughs> Just... Wow! Dude, not after you say that. Yeah. And then he does it anyway. Aha, uh -huh, I see. What? What? It does taste awful. Well, um... It's a huge improvement over the curry. Okay, okay. It's not as bad. Yeah, thanks for the consolation. I feel so much better. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Right, right. I think this tastes good, too. <laughs> Nanako is trying so hard to lie. Like, this tastes good, too? Nanako-chan! Oh no, Yukiko won't lie to her best oh, friend. Oh yeah, they're right. <laughs> they're totally right. It tastes awful. <laughs> and yeah, and of course she laughs. Yep. Then try Rizei Chan's. I bet you anything mine tastes better than hers. Oh. Let's see. Yukiko's dead. Heal her down! Heal her down! We just got you Recarm! We got you Recarm, Teddy! Teddy! Teddy, use Recarm! <laughs> Teddy! Teddy! Use Recarm! Senpai? <laughs> sure enough. One strike. One strike! Well, Yukiko and Chie's didn't taste good either. But at least theirs didn't cause any casualties. <laughs> <laughs> It's a taste too subtle for kids. It's a mature flavor. Hmm. Sure. You guys are just kids. I. I. Rize, it's okay. <laughs> oh, she's really crying. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, oh, Nanako couldn't. Nanako couldn't. Couldn't even. <laughs> Oh. I knew it. Nanako-chan's the most mature person in this room. She's like, well, I had to grow up somehow with my absentee father. <laughs> and my dead mother. <laughs> Crocodile tears. Oh, yeah. Didn't you make one too, senpai? Yep. You did? Yes, we did. Oh. Best one. Yep. It seems to have come out pretty well. She's eating it cheerfully. Hell yeah. Nanako finished your omelet. Are you full, Nanako-chan? We're still starving. Let's order pizza. If you're so hungry, then help yourself to an awful tasting omelet. Huh. Uh, I have a suggestion. <gasps> yeah? You guys know about the festival they're holding in the shopping district, right? Why don't no. we all go? 
No, what's that? Oh, that sounds good. Whoa. Does that mean the girls will be wearing yukata? Isn't that like not now though? Or is this something else? A festival? We'll bring Nanako-chan along too. I can come. Of course. Really? Yay! <laughs> Aww. That settles it then. Festival food always tastes great for some reason. Even if it ain't anything fancy. Hell yeah. Whew. We'll finally be able to get some edible food for once. All right. Yes, yeah, so we're going on an ooting. <laughs> you promised the others you'd go to the festival at the shopping district. The culprit has finally been caught. The rest is up to the police inquiry. The festival's on August 20th. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna say, we're still starving. We gotta eat tonight. Who's ordering pizza? The book explains different ways to prepare noodles from a variety of different regions. It sounds delicious. Maybe you should talk to someone about it. Ooh, you read your book as the rain spatters against the window. Your knowledge has greatly increased. Wait a minute. Are you telling me that reading while it's raining gives bonuses? Holy shit. Since you finished hyperspeed reading, you were able to read more than normal. There's still some pages of the ramen way left. You decided to save them to read next time. There's just so much in this game we keep learning! Well, we're reading again tonight! What do you think we're doing? We can read during the day. The rain doesn't seem to be letting up. Let's read twice today. Let's read all day! Decided to continue reading the ramen way. You read your book as the rain spatters against the window. Knowledge is greatly increased. You finished reading the ramen way. Knowledge has significantly increased, and your expression has increased. The hill overlooking town. Yosuke brought you here. I hated this place when I first came to Inaba. You, you can tell how small the town is from up here. Oh, okay. But looking at it now, it's a nice town. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Yosuke is smiling sadly. Oh. Still sad about Saki Senpai? Hmm. Not as much as last time. But I still feel lonely. Yosuke is looking far off. I want to tell Saki Senpai something. Yeah. That what's important isn't where you are. This town I hated so much, now I love it. I mean, there's still nothing here, but I have family and friends and you. Aww. The important things are never far off. They're all around you. Yeah. Yeah, we're all, we're all stuck together in that small little town. Connected. Aww. Yosuke seems a bit embarrassed. I always wanted to be special. Mm. I thought my life would finally have meaning if I was special to someone. Oh, that's... That, oh, that's a good line. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, chat. Whoa. Chat, how many people... How many people here in chat needed to learn this lesson growing up? Holy shit. It's not the idea about wanting to be special. Because a lot of people, I feel like, don't feel like they have the capacity to be special. So then they put their value in being special to someone else. Shit. Damn, that's... That's... Oh, that's deep. Yosuke, you've come so far. That's why I was really excited when I got my persona. Mm. But I really didn't need it. It's not what you have or what you can do. Oh, Yosuke, just keep going, man. Keep going. Yes, yes. Just being born, living your life. Before you know it, you're already special to someone. Oh my god, this is this is so good. You're right. Yeah. Like you. You're special to me, you know? Oh. <laughs> this is beautiful. Yosuke is rubbing his nose. You can feel Yosuke's warm trust. You can feel your relationship with Yosuke has grown deeper. That's some good shit right there. Holy shit. Oh. All right. Let's see if we can find everyone's house from here. Yeah. There's Juness, and that's the main street, so my house is there. The one with that funky roof. Oh. Cool. Meaning yours is. Oh, you spend a long while with Yosuke. Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, hey! Wow, what a great spread. I've never seen so many pieces of fatty tuna. Oh. Oh, this is their celebration about the case. Cool, cool. Well, if you're gonna have a celebration, yep. you can't do it halfway. Nice, nice. Celebration? Yeah. Ah, it's about this. Watch. Oh, okay. They're gonna do this on TV. I didn't care who it was. I was pissed off. I wanted to be famous. The suspect was often heard saying these things. Mm. The young suspect has confessed to being the culprit behind the recent cases, but he's shown no remorse so far. Don't you dare show his face. Because of several inconsistencies in the boy's deposition, mm -hmm. some have called good. for a mental examination to be carried out. Yep, good, good. Until then, the police will be continuing their investigation to shed light on all the prior incidents. Good, good. This is a good example of the cops being like really competent here. It's not that the cops are incompetent, it's that they had an impossible, impossible murder situation to figure out. So not only are they gonna do a mental examination, which is a really good call, they're gonna find out for sure, for sure, that this kid did not do it, that this kid saw an opportunity basically to basically be someone powerful and someone feared and someone even maybe even a bit revered for those who would be maybe sick enough to call this awesome or something. And that'll be basically the big twist like after we've had our like, oh, our lovely summer and then the police will be like, I don't think it was him. I don't think we got him. It was actually really tough to make a case out of this. Yeah, that makes sense. All we had was the suspect's confession and some circumstantial evidence. Cool, cool. But the lab found the perp's prints on the victim's clothes, so we made it stick after all. Oh. Oh shit. Which victim? Man, isn't crime or scene investigation them. something? Who would have thought you could get viable prints from cloth? Yeah. There's no more scary stuff to worry about. You're safe now. Okay. Uh-huh. Oh. Man, that guy was twisted. A high schooler committing multiple murders and leaving the bodies like that. He was over the edge. Adachi, we don't need to talk about this right now. Good thing we caught him. Now I can stop seeing suspects in every shadow. <laughs> if the killer was still on the loose. Of course, here we go. Enough, Adachi. If you keep running your mouth, the sushi's gonna dry up. Yeah, eat your damn sushi. Oh, you're right. Sorry. Come on, everyone. Eat up. Well, since you asked. Oh. Huh? You don't like sushi, Nanako chan? Oh, oh. There's wasabi in it. Oh. Oh, that's right. I forgot to tell him to hold the wasabi. Oh. Here, I'll take it off for you. Which one do you want? Hmm? Oh. Halibut. Oh, way to go. Dojima being Dajima. Yes. Excellent taste, Nanako chan. <laughs> As for me, I'll go for sea urchin. Nice. Hey, there's only one of those. Oh. Too late. First come, first serve. <laughs> it's been a while since dinner has been this lively. Oh. Cool. The more I look at you, the more you remind me of him. His nose was just a little lower than yours, and his eyes a bit smaller. And his hair was shorter. <laughs> <laughs> he was a handsome man. Oh, who are you talking about? <laughs> oh, my husband. He was a kind man. Quite an attractive one, too. Sano smiles nostalgically. Whoa. My husband passed away recently. Ah. Listen, dear. Do I look like death to you? Oh. Honesty. I see. You mustn't become death. Hisano smiles sadly. You feel you brushed against the heavy weight that Hisano is bearing. Whoa. When I'm with you, I feel like he has forgiven me. That can't possibly be true, though. After all, I'm the one who... Uh 
<laughs> I'll see you later, Kuwabara-chan. Funny. I remember this festival being a lot more crowded. Is it because of the murders? That would be the opposite reason, then, because the murder situation should be good now. Yeah, there ain't that many people here this year. Well, I guess you can't blame people for being scared. Mm. Haven't seen the reporters around, either. And they sure are good at stirring shit up and then disappearing. Mm. Well, it ain't so bad to have thin crowds. Yeah. What is important right now is that we go get some ikiyaki. Yeah. Ooh, I want to get some, too. Kanji, what's ikiyaki? <laughs> no questions. Food, now. Man, they're late. Aw. Why were they meeting up at Yukiko's house in the first place? They get changed, you dimwit. They'll show up sooner or... Here they are. Whoa, isn't that them? Yep. Oh, and Nani goes with them! Sorry Aww. we took so long. Oh, my heart! My heart! It took us some time to get dressed. Oh my god, this is so sweet. You have to wrap towels inside so they're not as breezy as everyone says. Ah, uh, sure. It's kind of hard to walk. No, it's okay. You just walk slowly. You look cute in it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Nanako seems happy. Nana-chan, you look so cute. I'm head over heels for you. <laughs> what? What is Kanji doing? He's looking the other way. Kanji, bro. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. How do we look, senpai? Does the sight make your heart skip a beat? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I was waiting for this shit. I was waiting for this shit. It is time for the group to see my love for Chie. What do you mean, actually? Sheesh, how embarrassing. <laughs> oh, whatever. Chie looks embarrassed. Kanji? Yeah. What are you looking away for? Yeah, yeah, seriously. Don't tell me you're ashamed to look. What are you, a monk? Th that ain't it. No, it it's a... Uh... <laughs> you're so cute, Kanji. Oh. Hey, thanks hey. for looking after her. Dajima, hi. They bought me cotton candy. That's all cotton candy? That's like half her size. Did they now? All right, then. You want to go over and do the target prank? Uh, I mean, game with me? <laughs> uh -huh. Let's go. Oh, I'll take sweet. care of Nanako from here. You better. It's only a few times a year that this town gets charged up like this. You kids should go and have fun. I thought he was going to say, like, it's only a few times a year I actually spend time with Nanako one-on-one. -on -one. <laughs> hmm. A summer festival. Hmm. Hmm. A what? couple walking together at a festival. Unused to wearing it, the girl's yukata comes loose. Summer has begun. What, 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 what are you watching on TV, Teddy? Like, what? What kind of tagline is that? Yeah. We gotta go two by two. Rawr. Oh, hell yeah. There's seven of us, so you know how this works out, Teddy. Two by two? Hands of blue. See, I've been thinking. It's the summer, mm -hmm. you're wearing yukata, and we're at a festival. It's just wrong for guys and girls to walk around in a huge group like this. Oh my god, Teddy, you fucking shipper. Set me up. We should couple up while we're here. It's the natural way of things. All right. But what the hell are you babbling about? Risei did not have the nervous, nervous sweat above her. The nervous water drop. Risei's like, hell yeah. I'm with Teddy. Oh, Risei, you're a genius. Going first, yeah. Come on, senpai. Why wear yukata in the first place? Mm. So we have memories we can remember fondly, right? And also, Risei going first acknowledges the fact that she realizes that I'm here for Chie. Respect. Risei's, uh, Risei's all right. So we should pair off right away. Yep, yep. Risei, what a terrifying girl. <laughs> you got a point, though. Good memories. 
Oh shit, Yukiko, I swear to god, if we get it if we get into a rivalry over Chie. Uh, I'm fine too. Oh, what I mean is uh, count me in. <laughs> All right, you guys decide how we'll split up. <laughs> huh? Seriously? It's up to us? Wait. Can the other friends get into relationships with each other depending on who we romance? All right. Three guys and three girls. What should we do? Yosuke, you're 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 not you're not paying attention. You're not paying attention, Yosuke. There's four guys and three girls. Three guys? <laughs> Aren't you missing one? What? <laughs> Me, him, and Kanji makes three. What? You did that on purpose. And Rise already chose Teddy. You can't do that, Yosuke. Um, should I really do this? Oh. Oh yeah, you can barely look at him. Oh. <laughs> no way. I can look at him. It'll be a cinch. Just you watch. Nah, you should bail, Kanji. It'd be best for everyone that way. No. What? You don't believe me? Yeah, 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 yeah. He's just messing. He's just messing. Well, I've made my decision. Oh. Hey, wait till we're done for that. I want Chie-chan and Yuki-chan and Rise-chan for my part. <laughs> I would like a harem. That's not a decision. Dude, you're the one who said we got to pair off in the first place. Pretty sure Rise meant I'm with Teddy's idea. Oh, oh, I see. I ain't joking here, Ted. If you try and butt in on this... <laughs> That's right, Kanji. This is serious business, and you're a true man. Indeed. A true man wouldn't be prancing around with other girls at a place like this. What? Uh, okay. Wait, what? How much more can you butter him up? <laughs> Kanji? This is a test to see if you can uphold your status as a true man. Oh no, wow, Teddy is good. <sighs> now no one will be left out. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Thanks, Teddy, you said it. <clears throat> okay, count me out. Oh my god, Kanji, you're so sweet and stupid, I love you. Dude, come on, don't fall for that. Hmm. It's decided, I'm going with all of you. No! That was not decided. Huh? What's going on? <laughs> oh, there are too many guys, so someone would have been left out. I just couldn't let that happen. Oh my god. What? You little... <laughs> I see. Uh, You're so kind, Teddy. Oh my gosh. We let them decide and this is what we get? <sighs> what a letdown. <laughs> oh well, let's go then. Oh my god. What? We fail, huh? I... We, we absolutely fail. The epic fail. I... We have to give this W to Teddy. Hey, Teddy! Why are you buying another idol's photo? Mine's in there too! Wow. Aw, oh, what's with this? <laughs> Oh, they're Teddy, gonna split up. They're all gonna split up. My oh, that's unforgivable. Save them! Save them! Summer break continues. The summer festival is being held at the shrine today. Oh, the summer festival is right now. Oh. Hello? Um, it's me, Chie. Uh, well. <laughs> you know that festival at the shrine? It's going on tonight, too. So, if it's okay with you, um, want to go there again today? This time, j just the two of us. How does that sound? Uh -huh. Okay, then meet me in front of the shrine. She hung up. Hatsuhime Shrine. Oh, date number one. Date number one! Mobile stalls are lined up from yesterday. Sorry for making you come to the same festival twice. Oh. It's a small shrine, so there's not much else to see, is there? Oh, it's okay. But, um, 
I wanted something to remember this summer by with you. I should have said this yesterday. I'm pathetic. <laughs> well, shall we go make a wish? Oh, classic. Oh, this is cute. This is so adorable. Yesterday, I actually wished that you'd come with me today. I can't believe it came true. Oh, yeah. Hey, what are you going to wish for? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's time. Yeah. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. oh, oh. <laughs> I wished for the same thing. <laughs> Except I added forever at the end. <laughs> she is smiling bashfully. <laughs> Money. <laughs> oh, you made your wishes together. Hey, why don't you two come over here? I've got the greatest candy apples in the world. <laughs> what is that voice? What is that voice? Hey, yo, come over here. I got some greatest candy apples ever. Come over here. Get some. Two of you. You two of you. You two. You two adorable little kids over here. Come on, you get your candy apples. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't know. I just ate one yesterday. Chie, you don't have to pretend. Tell you what, then? I'll throw in a free lottery ticket with each apple. You can exchange them right over there. Hell yeah. How about it? You want to share a candy apple with your boyfriend? Yeah. He called you my boyfriend. It's true. Wait. But that's true. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I'm not supposed to be nervous about this. <laughs> All right, then. Uh, two candied apples, please. One for me and one for my boyfriend. <laughs> Here you go. Aw. Once we're done with these, let's go around and see the other stands, too. And we can't forget about the lottery. Aw. Here, the Okonomiyaki is humongous. Do you want to share one? Ooh, I think I could eat one all by myself, though. <laughs> Whatever. One for both of us. That's two lottery tickets. Oh, okay. I am loaded, though, Chie. I These can buy a These goldfish fishing games always have a turtle swimming around in the bottom of the tank. Is that safe? Yeah. I heard in science class that pond sliders like eating fish when they're little. Anyway, I never really like these games. It takes too much of a delicate touch. Yeah, own it, Chie. Yeah, you don't have to pretend to be delicate and cute, feisty, and strong. Okay, you both get to draw once. Let me go get the lottery box. Okay. Okay, here we go. Now, close your eyes and draw your prize. Nice, nice little rhyme there. You drew one ticket. Sorry, you didn't win anything. Aw, oh, shit. Hold up there, young lady. You just took two. Ah! <laughs> uh, only one of them's a winner. Uh, that's okay, I guess. <laughs> she is like, what? I didn't do that. What are you talking a about? A sixth place prize. Here's your book. Ooh, we get a book. This book? Oh. You didn't get anything, right? Then you can have my prize. Oh. I keep handing this book out at town meetings and stuff. I think I have at least four of them at home. Oh, okay. Contained a book called The Divine Way. Was this written by the people at the shrine? <sighs> it took us two days to go through everything here. Don't worry, that's about how much time I'll go through, take to go through this book. <laughs> Hopefully this will be something we can look back on fondly. Yeah. <laughs> I had a lot of fun today. Oh, me too. Um, I've been meaning to ask this, but I talk about meat all the time, and I ate a lot today, too. Oh. But... Do girls who eat a lot turn you off? No. No, no. I like a girl who can eat. Hell yeah. Really? Yeah. I'm so relieved. <laughs> but I'm still going to stop talking about meat all the time. Not everybody's as understanding as you. Ugh, don't remind me about my understanding stat. No, she ain't. How could you do this? She doesn't know. She's innocent. She doesn't know. She doesn't know. She doesn't know I'm sensitive about my understanding stat. 
So if you don't mind, I guess it really doesn't matter what anyone else thinks. Oh. Well, guess it's time to go home. Thanks for today. Well, see you later. Okay. Oh, Kuabarakun. Um, what you doing? Seems she isn't busy. Oh yeah, I managed to get my license. I felt like Yosuke kind of dragged us into this, but once I took my scooter for a ride, I realized how much fun it is. I can't wait to go to the beach with you guys. Rank 10, here we go. Okay. Um, er, well, room? C can I go see your room? Uh, oh, after training, of course. That's all, so let's go. She looks embarrassed. Oh my God, she's just like, bedroom, now. <laughs> She wants my meat. Ah! Your room. She ain't begged to see it after training, so you brought her here. Hmm, so this is your room. It's pretty clean. Trying to keep the place tidy for when you move out. Oh. Oh, we're bringing up this. The future. Oh, shit. No, don't try to make me sad, game. Oh. Oh, well, how did the room you had back home look? Ah, it was messier. <laughs> yeah, oh, that makes me feel better. My room's covered with posters and stuff. It's a complete mess. Of course. Yeah, she is a bundle of chaos. <laughs> huh? Oh, um. Um, um, what? I'm sorry to barge in like this. Oh, it's all good. It's all good. She seems to be panicking for some reason. Some reason. Well, see, there's something I want you to hear. Only you. Okay. Um, I still don't have a clue what my good points are. Oh, it's a why do you like me situation because of her being friends with Yukiko and constantly feeling like she's number two and... Oh, and overlooked, and oh, oh, this is... But I thought I could just keep on searching. Okay. I was thinking maybe both of us together? Yeah, that sounds good. You're on your own? Who the hell would say this? Yeah. Yeah, she looks somewhat embarrassed. So, here. <gasps> oh, she's gonna kiss us. From me to you. Oh. Oh. Wristbands. Oh. Oh, and it's new, so it's clean. It makes a matching pair with mine. <laughs> yeah, she has all her wristbands. Oh. I think this power of mine is what I wanted all along. Yeah. The power to protect everyone. I understand now. I'm not supposed to use it to become more self-reliant. Sure. I'm supposed to use this power to protect people. Yeah. Yukiko, my friends, my family, this town, and you. Hmm. <gasps> Whoa! She, a strong will that allowed her to accept and overcome her weakness, has awakened her heart's true power. Shie's persona has been reborn? Tomoe has transfigured into Suzuka Gongen? She gets a double-bladed lightsaber? My new power. Oh my god. I have you to thank for this. I love you. Oh, oh, oh. You can sense Chie's intense love. You feel a tight bond between you and Chie. Max, baby! There it is. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a genuine bond. These genuine bonds shall be your eyes to see the truth. 
We bestow upon thee the ability to create Futsush Futsunushi, the ultimate form of the Chariot Arcana. Kubara Kurimi has forged a bond that cannot be broken. Chie is fidgeting. What should you do? Hug her. Oh, for sure. I just got done with training. It's okay, Chie. I am I'm still all sweaty. Oh. Wait, the, the, oh, that's not what I meant. Hug me back. What am I saying? Oh, that's just like you. What do you mean it's just like me? <laughs> Idiot. Yeah. You passed a long while with Chie. Morning. Is your motorcycle all gassed up? <gasps> Remember how I mentioned how we should all go to the beach before? Why not go today? This is just the best. This is just the best. <laughs> Senpai, is the beach really this way? We've been on the road for a while. I'm positive. But can't you smell the ocean? What smell? <laughs> you can definitely trust her on this, Rise. She's got the senses of a beast, remember? Hell yeah. <laughs> hey, what are you saying? Hey, you? I was complimenting you. You call that a compliment, you idiot? What kind of girl wants to be compared to a big animal, huh? <laughs> <laughs> hey, dude, give me a break. <laughs> <laughs> He's got roller skates. This is crazy. Why is he in his Why is he in his costume? The ocean. Oh. All right. Oh, it's pretty. <laughs> they see the end of the line. They're going. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. Wow, all right. Let's go. You know, I'm starting to get nervous. Why? We're at the ocean, which means swimsuits, which means reset live and in person. <laughs> what are the ramifications here? Am I using up my lifetime supply of luck with this? I feel like that with this stream, man. Everything's just going so well. Whoa. Whoa. Ooh! Aww, cute. How come you guys are here? You should be in the water! Oh, were you waiting for us? Of course. Where's Kanji? Dude, that's just insane! Kanji's got his speedo. Kanji's getting his speedo. Eh, I've already seen her shadow. I kind of want to see what happens if we say this. It's totally different. You better not say that to her face, okay? Yeah. Don't worry. Um, can we get going into the water? Sure. Yeah, yeah. Chie chan, Rise chan, and Yuki chan all win the Ladies of Summer competition. <laughs> I'm surrounded by such beautiful mermaids. I feel like this could be my chance for a summer romance. Like that had ever happened. Oh, damn. Where's Kanji? Yeah. I Where's he's our still boy? Out. Riding all that way on a bike really did a number on him. Nah. Oh, here he comes. He's got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's nervous about his swimsuit. Yep, yep. <laughs> Dude, what is that? <laughs> what's what? Yeah, what's what? Your swimsuit. What else would I mean? It's your basic black. What? Yeah, what the hell? I'm not talking about the color. I mean, I mean, the, the whole thing. It's a good thing they're not showing the other side right now. I'm seeing things I never needed to see. Bro, bro. You're the only one saying stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Yukiko might be a little nervous right now. <laughs> Don't act like you're not egging me on. Wait, Kanji, 
How come you're not getting a nosebleed over me? Huh? Why would that happen? <laughs> what? Ah! God, I love I'm these. I'm surprised they can get this worked up over just some swimsuits. I, I love this crew so much. Jeez, they're hopeless. I'm gonna go ahead and jump in the water. Chie <laughs> chan, Yuki chan, let's be mermaids! He went in first. Yeah. Come on, you two. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> oh. My feet don't touch the bottom anymore. Let's go over the You're just wow! Wow! Whoa! Cheer! Holy shit! I chose right. I chose right. Chie is the best swimmer, apparently. Other than kanji. Found a betting machine. I probably tied, you know. I'll go buy some drinks. You want a soda? Hell yeah. Ah! Uh oh. My string's getting undone. Teddy, I swear to God. Hey, Teddy, watch the hands, yep. pal. Of course. Aw, don't be so stingy. I think we're due for a wardrobe malfunction. Oh my God. What in the world are they doing? <laughs> Whoa, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> Kanji! <laughs> what now? Oh my god, wait! Got you, you bastard! Kanji's naked! Ah, Kanji's naked! <laughs> Teddy is censoring! Teddy is censoring the naked Kanji! <laughs> Busted! Hey, Senpai, this stupid bear here. Oh. You listening, senpai? Yep, listening Wait, just fine. Wait, hold it! Time out! <laughs> uh, look down! Down? Oh. He's like, oh. <laughs> Holy shit, the wardrobe malfunction was mine! Ha <laughs> ha! And we've got the danger music going. What are you doing? You need to cover up down there, damn it! <gasps> I give up! I give up! <laughs> hey, quit squirming! You run off and I'm toast! <laughs> but if I don't run off, my dignity will be in ruins! <laughs> oh, this is amazing! Why don't we take a break? Oh, here come the girls! I need to put on more sunscreen. Gotta take a break to slake with steak! Wow. Spitting rhymes. They're getting out of the water! Run! Run! Teddy, what gives? <laughs> I'm done for. <laughs> I'll go look for something. Sit tight. Yeah, go, 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 go. This is an emergency. You're a man, let him dangle. <laughs> uh, you're a man, let him dangle. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. Should... yeah. Clothes are overrated. Ah, that's pushing it. Why be in some serious shit? <laughs> <laughs> the voice actor! <laughs> I can hear the harps. Stay with us, Ted. <laughs> All right, Kanji, I found something. What is it? Like seaweed? Seaweed. I mean, that's actually pretty good. That's a good idea. Oh, there they are. Senpai! Uh. They're coming! Just hide it! Hide it? Yes. <laughs> yes! What am I supposed to say to this? Yes! 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 Oh, that's so much better than I could have imagined! Oh my god! Uh, we're, uh... <laughs> look how, I love how ashamed we look in the background. Reenacting the birth of Venus? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah I'm, I'm ready to be born, damn it! <laughs> A little bit of laughter. Oh my god. You sick of? Oh, oh. Well, okay. <laughs> that was rather quick. Was this the best idea? Not, but it was an amazing idea. Whatever else, it's giving me an itch. <sighs> oh no. Oh my god. Yes, are they burying Kanji? No, he's up there. We found his swimsuit. Okay, good. 
The sun is starting to set. Pretty busy day. Yeah. I'm still itchy. <laughs> of course you are. At least we had a laugh over it in the end, right? And we found your swimsuit, too. Well, I never would have come to the beach if you hadn't invited me. <laughs> I guess it would be out of character for you. It actually might be more fun to try stuff that's out of character. Yeah. Yeah. In a way, your nature is like a wall, after all. Hmm. Surrounding yourself with high walls makes things simple, but simplicity isn't always a virtue. <laughs> oh, man, what was that? Did I just get all philosophical there? Hey, you've grown up a bit, Yosuke. By all means, keep going. Oh, well, if I have your permission. Come on, you're embarrassing me even more. <laughs> I think it's fine. Yeah. I look at that big ocean out there and think, man, why keep hanging on to all this embarrassment? Just let it go. Yeah. So you don't deny that it was embarrassing, huh? Whatever. You hear the girls playing at the beach. Okay, why don't we play a game? Whoever loses has to buy barbecue on a stick for everyone else. <laughs> but that surprise only you would want to play for, Chie-senpai. <laughs> then the loser gets to smooch Teddy! Ah, uh, they can all have unique rewards. Talk about kicking someone when they're down. Then they're... instead of playing a game, why don't we do something else together? Like... Burying Teddy in the sand. You mean like giving him a sand bath? Oh no, my wrist is red. I was so careful to put sunscreen on too. Oh, that was cool. That was cool. Extra bits of dialogue there. They're in high spirits and having fun. Good times never last long. True. I wonder if our high school days will end that way too. Bro, don't say that. With all the doom and gloom. Yeah. Case is closed, man. If anything, I'd say we're just getting started. Mm. That's true. Man, though, this motorcycle trip turned out way better than I imagined. Ooh, idea. Hey, I've got an idea. Why don't we go skiing during winter break? Oh. Oh. Wait till you guys see how awesome I am on a snowboard. That's a brilliant idea. Talking about winter already? Getting a little ahead of ourselves, are we? Why not? Looking forward to it. Yeah! There's lots of mountains around here, so there's gotta be a ski slope somewhere not too far away. Sure. Oh yeah, tons of them. None of them are that close by, but it won't be too tough by scooter. Scooter might be dangerous, actually, during the winter. But we gotta stay safe. The roads look dangerous. We might have to change our plans. True. Man, I wouldn't have thought you'd be the one stressing safety. Bruh. What's the point of trying to act cool when it comes to that stuff? Danger's danger, man. Yeah, for real. Well, you have a point. All right, now that we have a plan in mind for winter break, let's start heading back before it gets dark. Yeah. We're all beginners at driving after all. Yeah, all right, let's head back. Hey, we're going home! And Teddy is buried. Show us Teddy buried. You enjoyed your day of swimming in the ocean and touring by scooter. It was a memorable day. Uh, you and your friends arrive at the hill overlooking the town. All right, let's see it. Ooh, the crowd's pretty thin here. Nice. The riverbanks were packed. I'm surprised you found a quiet spot like this. Yeah. Oh no, I knew about it. I pass by the mountainside a lot. Customers ask me about it too. I wonder if Nanako-chan will make it. I called and told her where we'd be before I left. Hey, where's Teddy? Uh, Not only was he know. hitting on girls nonstop, he accidentally put the moves on Hanako and she dragged him away. He oh, ducked into his Teddy. bear skin right away and acted like a bear, but he still got dragged off without a word. Whoa! Can we just leave him like that? He'll be sure fine. we can. His karma caught up to him. Yeah, he'll be fine. Aren't you being a little cold to Teddy today, Yosuke-senpai? Nah, it's fine. When I think back to what he did this morning, no, I really don't. <laughs> Truth be told, I wish I could send two or three more Hanukos at him. Damn. Dude, that would kill him. What happened anyway? <laughs> that would kill him. <laughs> I don't even want to remember it. He dug up some private stuff from my room and brought it to the Hanamura family breakfast. Bruh. He was all like, Yosuke, what's this magazine about? 
Dude, bro code. Can you imagine the humiliation I went through because of him? Bro code. It's your fault for having that stuff. No, not, not entirely, no. It's not like I ever thought anyone would wave it around in front of my parents. Yeah. Is this really what you want to be talking about with girls around? <laughs> it's true. Mm -hmm. Is he not talking about his secret savings? Ah. Uh. Secret savings for a guy. Right. Let's just leave him be. Good, good call. Good call. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Teddy. Teddy. Oh my god. What a tragedy. My lovely fur is completely ruined. <laughs> oh my god. That's... Okay, that's worse than I was expecting. Oh my gosh. Anyway, people are going to stare at you like that. Hurry and take it off. But I'm like a newborn child inside. <laughs> Where's human Teddy when this is going on? Just like your magazine from this morning, Yosuke. Quit reopening <laughs> this morning's wounds. You have zero chill, buddy. There they are. Big bro. Nanako. Hey, Nanako-chan. Looks like dojima son made it in time. Yeah. Yeah. Dad came home early. Awesome. Yep. Yeah. Nanako seems happy. Sorry if I made you nervous. I didn't quite finish my paperwork, but I figured a dachi could handle the rest. Sure. Hey there, little lady. <laughs> Wanna launch some fireworks of love with me? Bro, he's... Oh no, Dojima's right there. How do you do that? Well? Yeah, how does she do that? <laughs> Cut it out, Teddy! Do you want Dojima-san to haul you in? Things are heating up down there. Whoa, that was really bad audio mixing. What the hell? Does that mean it'll be starting soon? That was awful. Really? <laughs> yeah, give us the fireworks, please. Oh, of course it's... That's awesome. Aww, really? Nice. <laughs> no, 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 don't listen to him. Stop messing with her, Teddy. Sometimes you're unbearable. Was that supposed to be a joke? Aww. Oh, looks like Aww. this one's a doozy. Nice. <laughs> that concludes our program for the Summer Fireworks Festival. Whoa. Thank you for coming, and all of us here in Inaba hope to see you again next year as well. Damn, where was that, that broadcasted was from? Totally worth coming out here for. Because you got to stuff your face, right? So what? You were all munching on snacks too. Yeah. An extra large steak bowl doesn't qualify as a snack. Hey, yes, it could. Did you have fun, Nanako chan? Mm -hmm. I'm sleepy. Oh. <laughs> I'm not surprised. It's about time for you to be home in bed. Yeah. I'll take Nanako back. Make sure you guys don't stay out too late, huh? Yeah. Bye bye, Nana chan. <laughs> bye bye. No. Bye bye. Okay. Well, the fireworks were great, but I don't know. It just feels like summer's just about over. Mm hmm. Because it is. Why'd you have to bring that up? Right? I'm all right with that. When I'm working, I have to wear fall clothes during the summer so I don't get a sense of the seasons changing. But this hmm. year, I went to the beach and saw some fireworks. I even got to wear a yukata out to the summer festival. Wow. The festival, huh? Yeah. Well, thanks to a certain someone, I don't have anything but bitter memories of that. <laughs> really? <laughs> that someone is you. Yeah. Well, I had fun. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, you were good at that candy cutting. Wait, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I was expecting something more... more bittersweet and stuff. Like what? Right? Well, wait a sec. What does that mean? What are you comparing it to? Did, oh. did you go with someone else the next day? Oh. Hmm. 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 Oh, oh! Gee, you don't look well. Did you eat too much? Are you feeling bloated? No, it's not my stomach. It's 
So much as my chest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are people catching on? Dude, seriously? <gasps> uh, uh huh. <sighs> Yosuke, you really do only think about girls, huh? <laughs> like you're any different. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Should we have asked that kid to come with us today? Kid? What kid are you talking about? Uh, well... Oh... Naoto... Yeah. Oh, him. Yeah, I guess so. When you think about it, we were working on the same case in a way. Sure. Yeah, that's true. I mean, we might not ever see him again. I uh, wouldn't can't wouldn't count on that. I'd hate yeah. to leave it with him like that. I said some harsh things. You know, I remember him saying something that sounded pretty sad. Then again, I doubt he's the type who'd accept even if we had invited him out to see the fireworks. I wonder mm. if he's not here anymore. Might he seemed be. to be busy, so maybe he's already working on another case in some faraway town. Huh. Hmm. Oh, Kanji, it's okay. Sorry, I didn't mean to be a downer. There's no point in wondering what might have been. That's this whole game. That's the whole reason. No, no, Rize, that's... No, no. After the 60, 70 hours of playing this game, no, there is a point in wondering what might have been. That's... That's the whole point of this game. He was a pretty good-looking guy, too. He might have been a roadblock in... Uh, other ways. Yosuke! You really do only think about girls, huh? <laughs> Shut up! You don't have to say it twice! We ate a light dinner with the others and then headed home. <gasps> Naoto! Good morning. Good morning. Y you? You're that, uh, pint-sized detective. Wow. I beg your pardon? My name is Naoto. Please don't give people bizarre nicknames you make up on the spot. Yeah. Um, you know this is a high school, right? Yeah, I'm in high school. My cooperation with the police has come to an end. However, yeah, here we go. there are aspects of the case with which I remain unconvinced. Mm. There are some family-related issues as well, so I've decided to stay here for the present. When's the reveal that Naoto is also uh, potentially a girl? From today forth, I'll be a first year at your high school. A first year? Okay. Well. And I felt that I should at least introduce myself to you all. I trust our relations will be cordial, senpai. Sure. Senpai? That detective boy's our underclassman? Yep. 